everyone. Really good to see you. Hi, hi, good to see you. Yeah, we're here today. Erin is in her boat. Can you see her lovely green boat? Have you got something that you could use for a boat today? Hmm, what could you use? Have you got a box or a bucket? Maybe with something you can sit in? Because we're going to hear a story and sing a song all about boats today. So I think you might know this song. It's called Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Are you ready? Can you sing along with us? Are you ready, Erin? Yeah. yeah. Shall we sing together? Yeah. Do you want to count us in? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can you sing it really loudly now? How loud can you go? Row, row, your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Oh, well done, well done. Thank you, Erin. That was brilliant singing. And thank you too. I bet you sounded really great. We're going to hear a story all about a boat and a guy called Jesus today. Jesus calms the storm. Jesus was very busy. There was always lots of people who wanted to see him. So one evening he said to his closest friends, Let's go in our boat across to the other side of the lake. His friends got into the boat with him, and they set off across the lake. Jesus was so tired from teaching all day, and the boat was rocking so peacefully, so he quickly fell asleep. Suddenly, a strong wind began to blow, and the sky went dark. They were in the middle of a huge storm. The waves began to crash against the boat. In fact, they got so high that water began to spill into the boat. Wake up! Wake up and help us, Jesus! shouted Jesus' friends. We're going to sink with the boat! Jesus stood up. He wasn't afraid at all. Be quiet, he said to the waves. Be still, he said to the wind. Then everything was calm. Everything that was dark and dangerous and scary just went away. The day came, bright and clear. Peace. Jesus looked at his disciples. Why were you so scared? Jesus asked. Don't you believe that I will take care of you? And Jesus' friends knew they were safe. And they knew then that Jesus would always take care of them. Who is our friend Jesus? They asked one another. Even the wind and the waves obey him. Wasn't that a great story about Jesus and his disciples on the boat? Now I know that sometimes we can feel like our problems are just too big, bigger than us, bigger than anything. But what Jesus did there when he stopped the wind and he stopped the waves is he showed us how much he loves us and he showed us just what his power can do. Because 
He wanted us as his followers to see that no matter what, no matter how big those problems are, God will always take care of us because he's even bigger. He loves us so very much and he loves you so very much. And he is big enough and he is so strong and strong enough to take care of any problems that we have. So do you need God's help with anything? Did you know that if you need God's help, you can pray to ask God to help you and he will do it. Isn't that amazing? God loves to give us exactly what we need. So would you like to pray with me today? Dear God, I know that you can do anything. Help me to trust you even when I'm scared. Thank you that you will always take care of me. Amen. Well, it's been fantastic being with you today. I hope you have a fantastic day, whatever you do with the rest of today. Um, and hopefully we'll see you again next week. Bye everyone. Bye bye.